Hey guys, welcome to Trending Reviews. So today I have the iPhone XS Max, 64 gigabytes in what I think is the best color, which is space gray. Let's go ahead, give it an unboxing and get straight in. Okay, so let's go ahead and unbox this. That's the space carry there. I think this is probably one of the best colors from the lineup that iPhone have been releasing. So it comes with the plug. You have the AirPods, which are the wired versions. Now it's a bit of a shame, depending on the price that you're paying, I think it would have been a good gesture to at least have the wireless AirPods in there, but nonetheless, now this iPhone does come with fast charging. Again, an issue with this is that they don't provide the fast charger and you have to buy it separately. But nonetheless, you have the uh, iPhone charging cable there as well. And that's all you get in the box. So this phone is 1100 pounds. And for that price, it's the most expensive phone that I've ever bought. I would have expected a little bit more than just these items here. But obviously Apple wanted to go through a different strategy, which is one of the reasons why they're a trillion dollar company. So let's go ahead and take this off. And let's power it on. All right guys, so there you have it. That's the quick unboxing. I'm gonna give you a full review of this phone very soon. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that one. I've just set up face unlock. So I'm gonna see how quickly it will unlock the phone for me. Now when I use face unlock, the padlock icon will unlock detecting my face. Now it's recognized, I can just swipe up to unlock the phone. Now I'm gonna give you a comparison of the camera quality compared with the iPhone XS Max with my Samsung S9 Plus. So that's another video coming out very soon, so make sure you subscribe as well so you won't miss that one. I'm gonna go and give you a full review of all the features that come with this XS Max. I went for the Max because I think I just preferred a little bit more of the battery life. I'm used to phones with a larger screen, such as my S9 Plus, so I'm gonna be using this giving you a full review hopefully within the next week you will see that on my channel also check out my instagram at trending reviews i'm going to take some pictures using the iphone 10s max and give you some examples of portrait modes some video qualities and so on hopefully test out some of the slow motion on this as well with some good shots outside so keep an eye out for that if you have any questions drop them down below if you want me to review anything particular with the 10s max then do let me know in the comments below as well i'll try to do that for you guys other than that thanks for watching and i'll see you next time